And a little change up front, Alquava leading on the far side from Blood Moon. On the outside, Al Denemy, and in between them is Mimicking, Birdcage, and Red Star over China. The six runners tightly enough groups. They race to the final furlong. Alquava now taken on by Blood Moon. Mimicking under pressure in the center of the track. Red Star over China coming through in the center. Birdcage on the rail. Alquava in front now. And Red Star over China on the outside of Blood Moon as they run up towards the finish. Red Star of China finishing strongly on the near side. It's close with Alcawa, and they're followed in by Blood Moon and Birdcage. And a little change up front, Alcawa leading on the far side from Blood Moon. On the outside, Al Denemy, and in between them is Mimicking, Birdcage, and Red Star over China. The six runners tightly enough groups, they race to the final furlong. Alcawa now taken on by Blood Moon, Mimicking under pressure in the center of the track. Red Star over China, coming through in the center, Birdcage on the rail. Alcawa in front now, and Red Star over China on the outside of Blood Moon as they run up towards the finish. Red Star of China finishing strongly on the near side. It's close with Alcawa, and they're followed in by Blood Moon and Birdcage. And Xylan, I will excel, and Olivier over towards the near side. Little Treasure up the center of the track, followed by Mulcaya. And then Shark Island, Curly Locks leads on the far rail from Future Icon and Prance. Little Treasure coming through now in the center of the track and goes on a couple of lengths in front as they race towards the final furlong. Olivier on the outside, and they're being followed by Mulcaya and Prance. But Little Treasure is out in front as they run towards the finish and will score for Shami Heffernan. Olivier is second. Mulcahy is next, and they're followed in by Chestnut Fire. And Xylan, I will excel, and Olivier over towards the near side. Little Treasure up the center of the track, followed by Mulcahy, and then Shark Island. Curly Locks leads on the far rail from Future Icon and Prance. Little Treasure coming through now in the center of the track and goes on a couple of lengths in front as they race towards the final furlong. Olivier on the outside, and they're being followed by Mulcahy and Prance. But Little Treasure is out in front as they run towards the finish and will score for Shami Heffernan. Olivier is second. Mulcahy is next, and they're followed in by Chestnut Fire. In the center of the track is just the leader, Western Seaboard. On the far side is You Can Choose with Ability and Delivery. These are being followed by Calm Bay. Staying on on the far side now is Cat Will Do, and right up the rail is Dan's Gift. Ability and Delivery now taken on by Dan's Gift, and on the outside, Battler of the Boyne putting in a tremendous late run, and Battler of the Boyne and Robbie Downey have come right through now to grab Dan's Gift close home. Ability and Delivery is third. Cam Bay and Cat will do next. In the center of the track is just the leader, Western Seaboard. On the far side is You Can Choose with Ability and Delivery. These are being followed by Calm Bay. Staying on on the far side now is Cat Will Do, and right up the rail is Dan's Gift. Ability and Delivery now taken on by Dan's Gift, and on the outside, Battler of the Boyne putting in a tremendous late run, and Battler of the Boyne and Robbie Downey have come right through now to grab Dan's Gift close home. Ability and Delivery is third. Cam Bay and Cat will do next. So they're beginning now to race past the two, and London on the near side of Sun Glider, a couple of lengths further back to Herald the Dawn and Elder Rayner, then Blue Revelation as they race now towards the final 200 yards. London just the leader from Sun Glider, and on the outside, Herald the Dawn getting to them as they run now to the final 200 yards. It's Herald the Dawn who hits the front and running up towards the finish. Herald the Dawn striding away to win for Kevin Manning, London second, Sun Glider, Elder Rayner, Blue Revelation, and Dawincourt. So they're beginning now to race past the two, and London on the near side of Sun Glider, a couple of lengths further back to Herald the Dawn and Elder Rayner, then Blue Revelation as they race now towards the final 200 yards. London just the leader from Sun Glider, and on the outside, Herald the Dawn getting to them as they run now to the final 200 yards. It's Herald the Dawn who hits the front and running up towards the finish. Herald the Dawn striding away to win for Kevin Manning, London second, Sun Glider, Elder Rayner, Blue Revelation, 
and Darwin Core. Racing now with a furlong and a half to go. And Great Canyon on the far side, pressed now by Texas Rock in the center. Joella beginning to make ground in the center of the track as they begin the climb now towards the final 150 yards. It's Texas Rock on the near side, being pressed by Joella. On the inside is Great Canyon, but running to the finish, Texas Rock and Fran Berry will win it from Great Canyon, Joella, and Five Claw in fourth. Racing now with a furlong and a half to go. And Great Canyon on the far side, pressed now by Texas Rock in the center. Joella beginning to make ground in the center of the track as they begin the climb now towards the final 150 yards. It's Texas Rock on the near side, being pressed by Joella. On the inside is Great Canyon, but running to the finish, Texas Rock and Fran Berry will win it from Great Canyon, Joella, and Five Claw in fourth. They're followed by the fairy improving, brutally honest in between horses as they begin the run now towards the final furlong. Beach Mount Whisper is still battling on. Down the wide outside is William Ashford beginning a run with Pretty Famous, but Beach Mount Whisper in front. They're coming at him now, Pretty Famous, and William Ashford on the outside sweeping up on the near side to score, and William Ashford will get up and win for Tom Madden and John Hayden. Pretty Famous is second. Beach Mount Whisper followed in by Volt and Tags Island. They're followed by the fairy improving, brutally honest in between horses, as they begin the run now towards the final furlong. Beach Mount Whisper is still battling on. Down the wide outside is William Ashford beginning a run with Pretty Famous, but Beach Mount Whisper in front. They're coming at him now, Pretty Famous, and William Ashford on the outside, sweeping up on the near side to score, and William Ashford will get up and win for Tom Madden and John Hayden. Pretty Famous is second. Beach Mount Whisper followed in by Volt and Tags Island. Abaya comes next, being followed by Primal Show. After them is Eagle Valley, as they race now towards the final furlong. In the lead, Octavia, a couple of lengths out in front. Second is Vintage Charm. Abaya moves into third. George on my mind is fourth. They're racing up now towards the finish. Octavia all the way, out three in front. Vintage Charm, Abaya staying on third. As they run up towards the finish, it's Octavia and Connor King will make all. Abaya on the near side will snatch second from Vintage Charm. Primal Show, Eagle Valley, and after them is our Valkyrie. Abaya comes next, being followed by Primal Show. After them is Eagle Valley, as they race now towards the final furlong. In the lead, Octavia, a couple of lengths out in front. Second is Vintage Charm. Abaya moves into third. George on my mind is fourth. They're racing up now towards the finish. Octavia all the way, out three in front. Vintage Charm, Abaya staying on third. As they run up towards the finish, it's Octavia and Connor King will make all. Abaya on the near side will snatch second from Vintage Charm. Primal Show, Eagle Valley, and after them is our Valkyrie.